I think there's a value missed if all a recruiter does is match resumes to job descriptions. I've gotten in the habit of asking if we're playing darts or we're playing pool. A game of darts, you got three shots you're throwing at the board. And if it's it's a week where I'm focused on finding somebody talent, I can try and hit the bullseye for you and make sure that those three darts are placed as well as possible. Or at the start of the week, I can fire that cue ball into a stack of talent and see what goes in the hole. And I could scatter these resumes all over the board in front of you and say low experience, high culture fit, high experience, low culture fit, somewhere in the sweet spot and everything in between and then refine it backwards from there. But I think the key is just as any process would be is communication on both sides. We could spend 20 hours with an individual talking with them about what this perfect candidate looks like and still not know until it's sitting in front of them. There's going to be things we miss and gloss over. Nevertheless, sometimes it's much less time than that we're spending talking about an individual. But that live feedback that we got somebody in front of you, even if it's a no, give me a couple things that are on the right track and a couple things that are on the wrong track and help me refine it inward. That responsibility falls on both sides to get that feedback. I could stay quiet and say, all right, perfect. We'll get you three more. The second they say no. Or I could say, help me understand here. This was my impression or this, this was off the jump what I saw lining up. What am I missing? In the same way, they can call that out for me. I'd prefer they do. You know, in our initial chat, we said this and this. I think you did miss out on this portion of the skill set. I want to make sure and reconfirm how important this is to us. Perfect. Step forward. So that's where darts versus pool comes in. Out of the five must-haves, if I find somebody with three, do you still want them at your doorstep? Or do you only want maybe one or a couple a week and then they are perfectly in line? 